everybody. Um, I know this is kind of a weird angle, but I'm trying to get set up so I can actually create some lip creams live on this page. Um, I've been mixing up a lot of different things with our, our custom blend system, and I want to just share kind of what I've been um, doing. Um, I did a video, gosh, I think it was a couple weeks ago now, about how I mix my custom airbrush formula. Um, but we can really essentially make anything that we want as far as, I mean, whatever you want to create, you can make with the custom blend concept. So um, one of the things I wanted to do today is I wanted to make a lip cream. I've been wanting to make some more colors. Um, I'm always looking for like lip stains, creams that'll stay on just because I don't really want to reapply throughout the day. Um, you know, you get busy and you don't really want to reapply. So I'm always looking for the perfect colors. Um, so it's fun to be able to just create anything you want. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn around the camera so you can watch me mix up um, a lip cream. All right, so hopefully you guys can see. I've got... Let me just get it like that. Okay, so what I thought I would start with today is I'm going to start with Garnet Frost. Um, it's really, really absolutely beautiful and I'm in love with it. So I want to use that and it's kind of a frosty, kind of reddish mauve. Um, it's not like red, red like you would think Garnets are. Actually, I'm going to do two. I'm going to do two dashes of that. Okay, so I'm using my dash, which is an eighth of a teaspoon measurement. Um, and then just to darken it and give like more of a little bit of a brown color, I am going to use this one. Okay, so each of my circles is actually representing a dash. And then I do want to add um, just a little bit more of a gold shimmer. So I'm going to be using Sunlight Gold. And it looks like that. So I'm going to put some Sunlight Gold in. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to mix it up. We have to actually mix with our mixing knife right here. These are micro pulverized, so we have to make sure they're mixed real fine. They're such a fine powder that, and yes, I'm using the powder minerals. So once I get this all mixed up, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add something to make it more of that cream form that we're looking for for our lips. Oh, this is really pretty. Making sure that's mixed. Good. Ooh, it's not, it's a nice actual like kind of brown berry color. Let me move it a little bit closer so you guys can see that. Okay. Yeah, I like that color. Um, we could adjust it at this point if we'd like to. Okay, but I'm liking that. And what I'll have to do is I'll have to do a picture of it when I am all done on my lips so that you guys can see it a little bit better. So I don't think you can really see all right, so now I'm going to put it in my beaker. Um, you can use any container for this, it, it doesn't matter. It's just basically to mix it in. Put all my colors in there. Um, I use, I mix a lot of them up when I have wedding parties or things like that where brides want a customized lip color. 
I can, you know, mix up something that's going to match whatever they are going for as far as their wedding colors. All right, so now that I have my powder in here, I'm going to take the Fringe Benefit and I'm going to be adding four pumps of that into my beaker. All right, and now I'm going to do, you can do one to two pumps of pearl. Um, I think I'm going to do just one because I do have the other shimmer in there, the more gold shimmer. So one pump of the pearl. And then I am going to grab, actually, let me grab our Ultra Soothing. Let's see, where did we put that? Okay, so I'm going to grab Ultra Soothing. And I'm going to put 0.5 milliliters of that in. And that'll give some hydration to the lips. All right. And then let me just mix that. And I'd love to know what colors you guys like, you would like to see. Um, but this is actually a color for myself. I'm looking for something to wear every day. Okay. So let me just show you that. So it's actually a, a kind of like a, a brownish, a brown berry color. And I will actually put it on my lips and then do a picture on this post just so you can see, get the full effect. I'll do, um, I'll get my makeup light out and just so you can see the shimmer that way. But I just wanted to share with you how easy it is to customize lip colors with the additives that we have in the custom blend line. Um, the possibilities are endless. I'm sure you can see that I have all different um, toners and things back here that I could use. I have copper frost and diamond dust and you know every single color pretty much that there is. And so once you understand you know what colors you want and color theory, you can just kind of narrow down um, what additives to use and create a custom lip cream. So thanks for tuning in and I will post the finished look as soon as I'm I'm able to. All right, have a great day. Thank you.